हेलो गाइस लेट्स डिस्कस थ्योरम इन दिस वीडियो लेक्चर बेस्ड ऑन एंगल सबेंडेड बाय एन आर्क ऑन द सेंटर ऑफ द सर्कल दिस थ्योरम 10.8 सेज द एंगल सबेंडेड बाय एन आर्क एट द सेंटर ऑफ द सर्कल इज डबल द एंगल सबेंडेड बाय इट एट द रिमेनिंग पार्ट ऑफ द सर्कल यू कैन सी हियर हियर बीसी इज एन आर्क वेयर बीसी इज सबेंडिंग सम एंगल BC is subtending. Let's suppose this is X subtending some angle at center, and it has been said that it is also subtending an angle at some part, at some remaining part of the circle. It can subtend some angle at any part of the circle. Let's suppose this is A. Now, you can see here, this is A, this is B, and this is C, and this is O. now in abc this is o as you know that this is an isosceles triangle boc and aoc and aoc these are an isosceles triangle as this is equal to r and this is equal to r when two sides of a triangle are equal then that triangle will become an isosceles triangle so triangle boc aob and aoc they all are an isosceles triangle now let's suppose if and you know that Angles opposite to the equal sides of an isosceles triangle are equal. If this is theta, this will be also theta. And if it is theta one, so this will be also theta one. Now you need to find out the angle at this point and this point. Now, in triangle A O B and in triangle A O C. Here, C A O B and A O C. Now you need to find out angle sum of angle of theta sum of angles of a triangle is equal to one eighty degree. So theta plus this is theta plus theta plus angle A O B angle A O B. This is equal to one eighty degree. So now. What will be the angle AOB? It will be equal to one eighty degree minus two theta. Now, in triangle AOC, it is theta one plus theta one. Now you need to find out this angle, theta one plus theta one. Let's suppose this angle is COA. Angle COA. This is equal to one eighty degree. So now, angle COA is equal to one eighty degree minus. Two theta one. This let's suppose this is equation one, and this is equation two. You need to find out this angle, which is x. You know this angle plus this angle. This is one eighty degree minus two theta. This is one eighty degree minus two theta one, and this this whole angle. This this angle is this angle is three sixty degree. You know that angle subtended at a center of a circle is 360 degree. You know that angle on a line, angle on a line is 180 degree. When you make this a whole circle, this is also 180 degree. So sum of this is 360 degree. Now let's sum this plus this plus x, which is the angle at O. Now one plus two plus x. So what you'll get? This is will be equal to 360 degree. Now let's angle at calculate. Angle at one, which is coming out to be one eighty degree minus two theta plus from the equation two, you are getting one eighty degree minus two theta one plus x is equal to three sixty degree. One eighty degree plus one eighty degree is three sixty degree minus two theta minus two theta one plus x is equal to three sixty degree. Three sixty degree and three sixty degree will get cancel out. So what you'll get? You'll get two theta. Plus two theta one, so x is equal to theta plus theta one. Angle at A, angle at A is theta plus theta one. Sum of both the angles. Now let's see, x is double of this angle. X is twice at angle A. So from here it has been proved that the angle subtended by an arc at the Center of the circle is double the so angle subtended by it at the remaining part of the circle. 
what is the remaining part of the circle remaining part is a a is lying on this circle angle subtended at a is theta plus theta 1 and angle subtended at the center of the circle by an arc boc is twice of this angle so hence proved that angle subtended at the center of a circle will be double of the angle subtended at the remaining part of the circle i will be taking one more theorem in the next video lecture thank you